let with the vector space over R consisting of polynomials of degree less than or equal to 3. Let a linear transformation or operator T defined from V to V means vector space to vector space and image of domain elements is going by this relation Ft plus 1 means 1 exceed in the parameter and this is another map or operator send domain elements to its derivative then t is a polynomial in d what its meaning t is polynomial in d as we say polynomial in x it means that c n x raised to the power n c n minus 1 x raised to the power n minus 1 and so on plus c naught this is polynomial in x if t is a polynomial in d then t can be written as c n d raised to the power n plus c n minus 1 d raised to the power n minus 1 these are suffix or superscript as how many times we differentiate or we apply operator D this is how many time how many times operator D used operator D used please do not understand this as a exponent its simple meaning operator D apply how many times means D square means D of D F this is the meaning D of D F D square and so on up to C note this is the structure of T in terms of D but I am going I am going to solve this problem by matrix representation you can solve by this because we know the operator d d and t so we can write operator t in matrix representation as well as matrix operator d in matrix notation this is basis 1 x x square x cube basis 4 p3 r means polynomial of degree at most 3 degree at most 3 this is notation and this is a standard a standard basis so t send image of f as f t plus 1 and d send image of f as f prime t this t is parameter parameter or variable so represent t with the standard basis beta and represent d in matrix notation with respect to same basis because t and d both are defined over same vector space means domain and codomain so there is no need to consider another basis this basis will work for domain and codomain both so these are basis element 1 x x square and x cube this is basis element basis elements and the this is the column of basis elements image elements image means t of element if this is a basis element then you can consider this as ft one by one we will consider ft or in terms of x you can you can write
so one by one we will consider this element so t send this image as in parameter x seed 1 means same x seed 1 means t plus 1 this one will be t plus 1 whole square and this one will be t plus 1 cube we can write this one as t square plus 1 plus 2 times t and this one can be written as t cube plus 1 3 t square plus 3 t and this is the column for d means map d or operator d and this is basis elements image so d send elements to its derivative so derivative of 1 is 0 derivative of t is 1 derivative of t square is 2t and derivative of t cube is 3t square from this one matrix representation will be write image in linear combination of basis element like 1 dot 1 plus 0 times x plus 0 times x square plus 0 times x cube you can write this one as 0 times 1, one time 1 plus 1 time t because this is parameter t so write in terms of t 1 time t plus 0 times t square plus 0 times t cube and similar here so coefficients of this linear combination become columns so first column will be 1 0 0 0 second column will be 1 1 0 0 third column will be 1 2 1 0 and this one will be 1 3 3 1 this is matrix representation for t so t beta we can write and this is matrix representation of d with respect to same basis 0 0 0 0 1 0 0 0 0 2 0 0 and this is 0 0 3 0 we have matrix representation now asked about t can be written as t can be written as in terms of d in terms of d it means all columns of t means all columns of t can be written as in terms of can be written as in terms of linear combination of columns of d beta d beta means matrix representation of d see here this is first column this is linear combination of this one directly or same this column can be written as this one or this one we will use these two column how this is c2 means c2 means these are columns of operator d representation c2 minus half or 1 by 2 c3 now this column can be written as this one this one and this one 
how c2 plus c3 and last entry is 1 so 1 upon 3 c4 and this column can be written as c2 plus Three three one three by two C three plus C four plus E four E four means E four means zero 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 one. We can add extra column as this is a basis element. So we can add extra column. It doesn't affect uh, the linear combination. So we can write all columns of T with the help of columns of D. So T is a polynomial in D. This is true statement. 